Tom, what's the mood like in the camp at the moment following that nil-nil draw on Tuesday? Yeah, you know, the boys are still positive. Um, we know we needed a reaction from Saturday and I feel like we got that. We just didn't manage to get the ball in the net Tuesday, but hopefully we can we can do that tomorrow and get three points. Is that something that's currently playing on the group's mind, the, the lack of goals, especially at home? I think it's four on the bounce now without a goal, but there's still that, hopefully, that belief there because we've seen that this group can score goals, i.e. Hartley pulled away. Yeah, and we're creating the chances, which is a good thing. Um, so we know one's going to fall our way and, you know, I feel like the... We're not that far away from you know another Hartlepool game where we go score two, three, four goals in a game. Um, so hopefully that can be this weekend and, and we we come out with the win that we need. For yourself, you've played in a, a number of positions so far this season, but we've seen you deploy further up the pitch in recent weeks. Do you look very comfortable in that role as well? Yeah, no, I'm, I enjoy it wherever I play on the pitch and I'll always give give my all, whether that's up front, on the wing back, um, in midfield, you know, I'll, I'll always do as good as a job as I can for the team, and you know, we're playing up front. The onus is to score a few more goals, and that's hopefully that something that I'm going to work on and improve on, and and you know, add a few more before the, now the end of the season. You look like you're really enjoying your football as well. Is that the case? Yeah, no, I, lo I love it. You know, I'm playing week in week out, and you know, hopefully, I'm paying the gaffer and, and hats back with with my performances because, you know. You got to go out and enjoy every game. Although results haven't been great recently, you know we're in a very privileged position to be to be footballers. So yeah, every time I step on that pitch, I've got a smile on my face, and you know hopefully that can bring out my best football. On to Gillingham this weekend. Nice, you know, really went for it in January, and, and in doing so, they've picked up the results. So you know they'll be coming into this game high on confidence as well. Yeah, definitely. You know, it's probably a little bit of a different team than what we played earlier on in the season. Um, so, you know, every game in this league is tough. Anyone can beat anyone. So, um, you know, we've got to go into it, start fast and, you know, really take it to them and, and show the fans mm. what we can do and hopefully we get three points. On the fans, it's our school partners game this weekend. It's the most tickets ever sold, close to 1,700. Coming out to the community stand to see, you know, well over 2,000 in there. Must be a real boost for you as players as well. And it's hopefully about inspiring that next generation of fans. Yeah, definitely. You know, they're they're always enthusiastic. You know, when they come, and you can always hear them. So, yeah, hopefully we can put on a good show for them, and they they come back, and like I say, we can inspire them to keep coming week in week out, and maybe turn one of them into a footballer or something.